One Douglas County man is behind bars tonight, accused of threatening the Douglas County Health Director over her involvement in the response to the coronavirus. Reporter John Madden has more on what happened and how law enforcement officers were able to track down the suspect. Douglas County Sheriff's Office received information that Douglas County Health Director Dr. Adi Poor had received multiple threatening and disturbing emails. To Those emails email allegedly threat. came from this man, 57-year-old Ronald Pinskowski, also known as Ron Gerard, a former Omaha meteorologist and spokesperson for former Omaha Mayor Jim Suttle. He was arrested Tuesday for the threatening emails. The emails threatened to lynch her and to slice her throat. Captain Wayne Hudson says Pinskowski was upset over Dr. Poor's involvement with the response to the coronavirus, like telling people to stay home. He started sending those threatening emails over a period of a week from multiple accounts hiding his identity. The email was uh, changed at least once when he was blocked, but one could suppose that he was blocked by Dr. Poor and, and did not know that it had risen to the investigative level yet. Will Wren of the Sheriff's Office says investigators were able to track down the emails coming from a cell phone belonging to Pinskowski, to which they arrested him at his home on Tuesday. When we did arrive and, and he was met at the door, um, I got the distinct impression that he was unsurprised that uh, surprised but not surprised uh, as, as if he knew exactly why we were there. Now authorities want to use this case as an example for any other threats made towards public officials. The sheriff's office takes these threats seriously. If we receive any further reports of threats, we will investigate thoroughly and the individuals responsible, we will request that they be prosecuted fully. As for Dr. Poor, Douglas County Commissioner Chris Rogers says she's equipped to handle this. She does have some concern, but you know, she's tough and uh, she should make it through this. And he also warns the public frustration may continue to grow as the coronavirus spreads, but violence is not the answer. This is going to get a whole lot worse before it gets better. So I want to make a continued plea out to the citizens in Douglas County and to the citizens of Omaha to give us patience on this. In Omaha, John Madden, 3 News Now. The sheriff's office says no weapons were found in Penskowski's home when they arrested him. He's currently being held in Douglas County Corrections and is charged with making terroristic threats and stalking.